various positions, you know. So I think it's, it's something that is normal in politics. It happened in 2014. People moved from one platform to another because they believed that they saw an option. Now certain people, because of they perceive that certain things are not going their way, they believe instead of staying in to try and, and, and fix things from within for yourself, you feel the only option or the easiest option is to jump shit to another place that already, I mean, for me, I, I, I see it as um, a no-go. So it happens, and like I said, politics is politics. We're just seeing it happen. Like you said, you, uh, more would come. Well, I, don't, uh, I, I pray it doesn't, but if it comes, we will still continue because why? The APC is owned by Nigerians. If you travel the length and breadth of this country, the common people of this country really see the APC as the only platform that would meet their own yearnings. Mm. Well, 2019 will decide if that's the, really the case. But, uh, but, you know, some of the challenge that this poses now is the Senate, at, at the floor of the Senate. How is the bill, the request that the president made, how is that going to be attended to? Because if uh, the members of your party, the APC, are not able to get to a third to come in or reconvene the Senate, this is going to be a challenge. Isn't this in any way going to affect governance? Well, well um, um, would like, uh, after the defection, before they went on um, recess, I think the um, uh, Senate leader came out and he rolled out some numbers for us, which clearly shows the APC is still in majority. Now with the defection of the Senate president, let's wait and see the numbers. But of course, uh, naturally, if you do not have... Uh, the required numbers. Of course, it could be a, a, a problem in terms of passion or getting what you want through. But I still believe that with the numbers we saw, I mean, it's still debatable because uh, one side is saying this, one side is saying the Senate le uh, leader has spoken. Uh, we are watching, like you said, when they resume. But of course, everybody would have wanted a, a, a majority. But for me personally, I look at it like even with the majority before, the certain people today who have left the, the APC were the opposition to the APC in the, in the Senate. So for us, like um, uh, many who have also said, it's like um, we're kind of happy. Let us have peace now. Let us try as much as possible to go out there and like, sell ourselves to Nigerians like we did in 2014. You see, so, but um, for the numbers, I, I really would want to, to, to wait to see exactly what they would be in terms of that. But, of course, I believe we still would have majority. You mentioned personal interest as the reasons for these defections that we've seen and recorded up till this time. As a matter of fact, was also getting from feelers from the, uh, from the dailies this morning that uh, even Tambual himself will be defecting uh, very soon away from the, uh, from the APC, your party. But how has this defection placed your party against the opposition in terms of the key drivers of the APC and the strengths of your party? Well, so, uh, sorry, I didn't hear that last bit, but I believe um, uh, the, for the, like I, uh, the defection that you say is in the papers of um, Sokoto State Governor. Well, like I said, nobody wants to lose a member or a group or a friend. Nobody, we don't, nobody likes that. And also the APC is not, is not um, any different. But like I said, we would continue to move towards, I mean, uh, 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 delivering dividends of democracy to Nigerians, which is the most important. Yes, um, um, big weeds would come to the business and, uh, and go, but at the end of the day, the APC will remain. And uh, what is fundamental to, uh, for the APC is the core values of the APC, what we are selling. That is the most important. I always use an example when I talk about um, these things, like the, the equity election, if you look at. It was not about propaganda. It was just simply about, I mean, our candidate family stuck to the issues. Others were there really doing propaganda. At the end of the day, Ekiti, the good people of Ekiti saw between the lines, and they spoke, and they spoke well. So I think that is what we would see uh, going forward. People really, at the end of the day, would move towards what they feel is right. And I feel today, really, the best vehicle for us today in Nigeria is the APC. So, uh, uh, the second part of my question, which you didn't really address, how does this affect the strength of your party against the, the PDP, where most of these defections are tending towards? Well, well the, the, the strength of the party, like I said, remains strong. It remains very strong because 
Uh, let me, uh, if we look at Sokoto from my own perspective, if you look at the gov, you say, yeah, the governor might be leaving, yes. But we also have a very strong politician who, in the sense, the former uh, governor, who is a very grassroots, strong, grassroots, well-grounded politician. So at the end of the day, for me, I still believe that it's all about numbers and how you look at it. Like I said, the, the, the generality of people, politics is about majority. Politics is about, it's about people. And if the people, uh, I mean, are, are, are on ground, you understand, I still think it's still a, a plus to the PDP. One person is leaving, fine, he's the governor, and the governor, yes, is really a big bigwit, but we, there are also other people in that state. And I think from what I've heard, he's leaving because of he's, he's having problems with the, the, uh, the, the former governor, who is also equally as strong and as powerful. That is what I'm hearing. So I believe that at the end of the day, the people would decide. So it, 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 it's, it's not going to, for me personally, I don't think he's um, defection. If he does, he hasn't done it. If he does, you know, it would not, um, I don't see anything, uh, uh, any major problem for us. We will go out, like I said, campaign, and um, the people will decide. All right, thank you, Mr. Mohamed.